Hello and welcome to No Man's Sky, everybody. Alon Paul here with your Weekend Anomaly mission. And we're going to start right here from inside said anomaly. Go ahead and get going. With my regular save, next time we may be doing it on our tertiary save. So we'll see how that goes. Not sure how that's going to work out, but uh, we'll see what happens. Looks like we are eliminating hazardous flora this time around, and we'll go ahead and get this started. So this one's going to give me 1800 quicksilver, of course, just like everybody else. Salvage data times three. But there's usually a second one. There it is, 432,000 units. So we're going to go ahead and initialize the mission and get it started. Now I happen to be in multiplayer, as you can see. No big deal. All right, let's go ahead and get started here on our way hope everybody's doing well this weekend there will not be a stream this weekend a little busy we'll be getting out of town a little bit both on saturday and of course definitely on monday for the solar eclipse i hope to show some folks on my instagram account some of the pictures that we come up with and the experience That'll be a really special event. We saw the one back in 2017. We're looking forward to the one this year, 4824. All right, let's see. We're in the system. It's going to direct us to a planet. Oh, uh, nope, that's not it. Uh, wait a second. Wait a second. There it is. This way. Okay, so that's where we're headed. Looks like a regular ordinary space station here. Let me check something about the space station. Ah, it is a pirate or is it a that is a derelict space station so we're in a system that has not been huh yeah, we got freighters I'm going to check out the space station I'm really curious now is this a pirate system or not didn't look like one I mean that the station's all falling apart and everything like that normally yeah, see, this is not a pirate system, so what are their freighters doing here? Normally you don't see any freighters in a system like this. And there's ships inside here. This is like all kinds of creepy. They're just standing there. else think this is kind of creepy they're all literally standing next to their ships not doing anything except this guy he has to be doing something okay so it looks like regular trading is available but I've never seen anything like this this is really really creepy strangest thing I've ever seen. Do the ships leave? Let's go in here if I can get up the, over the railing here. Nope. Everything's the same back in here as with any derelict or abandoned station, if you will. But the ships... Oh, they do leave. Alright, so that is not as creepy as I thought. Okay, I thought they were just here. have an atlas pass so okay all right nothing special let's move on creepiest space station yeah and i'm sure you guys are going to be commenting as well when you see the video for this creepiest thing i've ever seen Advanced ranks in the plant's catalog milestone. Fantastic. I didn't even catalog anything. Very weird. Okay. Well, let's get out of this abandoned station and head out. Alright, we're on our way. Sorry we did a very strange thing there. 
Alright, so where were we? Back to the mission, right? A little bit put off by that one. That's kind of weird, isn't it? Very strange. This planet is way out there, it looks like. It's very far out. Let me see what we got. Stellar Corruption as well. So, this is going to be a very interesting planet. We got activated emerald on it, ammonia sodium, high sentinel activity. Should be able to do what we need to do here, but let's find out. So, it's leading us to a very odd planet. Turn back around and get ourselves reoriented. Looks like we're coming in in the middle of a storm. Hello. Yeah. All right, so we need our radar because we're looking for... We don't really need the radar. We need to look for the guy who died before us. I think we're going to have to just land. I literally can't see anything. Oh, I think we found it by accident. Look at that. So that little uh, diamond symbol at the top with the grave marker in the middle of it is what we were looking for. Literally, I landed right on top of it. Are you kidding me? Sure enough. Uh, well, at least we can access it. That is hilarious. Oh, keeping your gravestone warm there, my friend. Right. Something snagging around the ankles, piercing, thorns. Psst. Completely unaware. Reduced. We reduced the numbers, bud. And that's the end of him. Fallen Traveler's Log seems to mention the floral infestation, but holds no further clues. I will need to scout to locate the hazardous flora. Okay, now we can get the job done. Now this is an odd planet. Fortunately the storm just ended. There isn't going to be... looks like we got plenty of plants around us. Alright, so we have a cave nearby. That's a good thing. We can always head into the cave. But how many do we need? Eleven? We're gonna go to the runic lens to get rid of our guys here. There's one. Okay, it says two weeks, so you know what we're going to do? You know exactly what we're going to We're going to head into here. There's one right there. Two. Three. Fortunately, we're not building anything this time around. Oh, that means I missed one. Four. Anybody else? No. Not bad. Good start. Now we just need to keep our eyes open. Looks like there's one right there. A couple of them, actually. There we go. Head for the caves, my friends. Since this planet has them, use them. Plus you're protected from the elements at the same time, which is a good thing. Just don't get too close to them, right? Alright. So it doesn't look like this cave, it goes very much deeper. Let's go ahead and do it right here. Let's see what Nope, that doesn't really go much deeper after this. Yeah, that looks like it was about it. Looks like I destroyed everything in the path anyway. All right. And turn on our torch because this planet tends to be really, really dark. All right, so we got a few of them here. So we got up to six. That's not bad. Looks like we got one right above us over here. There we go. Seven. And I'll take a look around. So it says it's too weak, but don't forget what I said about that, too. Go to a different area and let the rain generate. It should bring up more. And of course, if you are looking underground, looks like we got somebody right there. If you are looking for underground locations, just look for plants that are underground. 
look for any items on the route. Submerged relics are one thing you can go with. Oh wow, they're just like all over the place. Got it. And there you go. And that takes care of our mission. We just need to head back to our ship. So this is a very odd planet. Not very pretty, if you will. There we go. Made it. And here we are. Back where we started. Alright, so let's head on out. Very odd planet. Colorless, I don't know, colorless and dark, gray, something along those lines. So we're going back to the space only. So even if you're a newbie to the game, if you have a new save, this should be one that you should be able to complete pretty well. Just keep an eye open, watch for the plants, don't get too close to them. Mining lasers work really well, so you don't have to use any ammunition, any guns. Um, going into caves is your best because you will be protected from the elements. Go. Now let's head on over and we'll claim our reward. And here we are. Looks like we had someone had joined us on this mission. We didn't even realize it. That's no problem. Mission's been completed. All right. Excellent. So everything worked out there. As usual, we'll head over to the Quicksilver vendor and check them out. And see where we are with our exotic items. Ah, it looks like we got past Tier 1 and Tier 2. We're into Tier 3 now. So these two are up for uh, purchase now. The Fluttering Decal for 400. And the Coleopterology Decal for another 400. The last one should be opened up hopefully in the next week or two. So we'll see how that goes. And that should take care of it. All right, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you've enjoyed the mission. I'm going to check over here at the monitor station like we keep talking about. Not this one. That's not even one. It's this one right here for the expedition terminus because we want to see sooner or later we will have more expeditions. At least that's what we hope for. It's what we hope for, but nothing yet. Okay, so we'll go ahead and let this go. I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of the Weekend Anomaly Mission. And if you have any questions, by all means, put them in the comments section. I always like to get back to people as I can, though I will be away this weekend. I'll do what I can to answer any questions you might have. Thank you very much for watching. Please hit the like and the subscribe buttons if you would, and we'll see you again next time. Take care, everybody.